Hey everybody, if you want to find out which is the best block theme template for you to get started, you are in the right place. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how you can create your website, your free website block, wherever you wanted to, totally for free. So if you go into the Pantheon dashboard, here into the Pantheon.io, what I did is to actually create my account and create my very first website. So for example, you just go into the home section and here I can choose create a new site like that and here I'm going to choose WordPress. So this is going to be helping me to access to a few tools that of course uh, WordPress is going to be charging for you. In our case we don't want to get charged for that. So here I'm going to type Steven Blocks for example and choose your region for your site, United States and here's the upstream WordPress. So we hit it to continue and just like that I have now been created my website, my free website with free hosting and of course there's a free URL. So with that being said, now we are into the dashboard. Here it says deploying the WordPress. What you want to do is just to wait a few seconds until this has been successfully uh, added. Get it into the X mark and it's gonna just wait a few seconds here. Now I have been successfully have my Pantheon on site dashboard. So I'm gonna get into the view my dashboard. And right away I'm gonna get into visit development site so I can start editing my website or in our case some blocks. So this is going to be helping us a lot to figure out which is out the best three blocks. So in here I want to look for my name, Steven Blocks. Here I'm going to just copy and paste this username. The passcode I want to change that of course the next time I want to enter in here. And here's my email. So I'm going to enter, install the WordPress. And we are now inside here. So I'm going to hit into the login. Here's Steven Blocks. You want to import Steven Blocks and here into your passcode. So you're now inside WordPress as a developer mode. Developer mode, uh, mode. So what you want to do now is to go into the actual plugins. And here as you can see, we do have two, three plugins. For example, the Hello Dilly, the Ask Meet. Is quite possible the best way in the world to protect your blog from spam, and there are a lot of stuff that we can use. So, if I go into the, uh, I'm gonna go here into tools like this, I'm gonna hit into the plugins, and here I want to go for the inactive, and I want to active uh, both of them. Or, what you can do is to hit into add new, and here I want to look for the elementor that can be helping me to add uh, compatibility mod stuff, for example, this one compatible with your version of WordPress. Here it is. So I'm going to go into the install now. And we are actually good to go. So I'm going to just make a quick installation of this one. So once we do are now in here, we are now going to be part of the Elementor website builder. So what I just need to do is to actually create my account. You just connect your account if you already have an account. Set it up. So I'm going to hit into connect. Just like that, I am now inside the Elementor. Continue with Hello Theme, like this. And here is my site name. I'm gonna hit into Next once again. Have a logo out here, um, or just gonna skip this for a second. And you can edit a black Canva or choose templates or import your own. And this is the very most interesting part. Now, speaking about blocks, you want to choose Enable the carry with this says Block Magazine. And here have black uh, a blank canvas, a travel block, this porch block. So as you can see, this is how it's going to be looking our our custom stuff. I think like for a very free version, it can be like really really useful to look for something that can be really really uh, accessible. So you want to look for kits by plan. Do you want to enable free? And I'm going to just disable the blog magazine and see all of them that are totally for free. For example, you have the local brand wireframe, and we have the juice bar. And I think that I can stick around with that. I love that one. I'm going to hit into the view demo. And this is how it's going to be looking our custom, uh, our custom block. So if I want to speak about a restaurant, if I want to speak about um, a bar or an item, a product, I want to make a review. I think that this block is going to be helping us a lot. This template is going to be helping us a lot to look this a little bit more um, professional. So all the elements that are in here are now being added successfully. So. Uh, as you can see, this one has been added automatically. So if you like that, you can go into the apply kit and hit into the apply all. 
setting up your cat hit into enable so hit into see it live and here is my website being created the elementor preview and now we are actually good to go of course we need to edit all of this stuff because i don't want to focus in here so we're going to hit into the close bar you can go into the elementor here and you can go into the all the pages actually and here what you want to do is to edit page by page for example the very first one which is the title for example this one of the Stephen blocks and here into the edit edit with elementor and it's going to be popping up the section where i can just drag and drop a few stuff for example this one and there you go so for example i want to delete this one and tap into the Stephen blocks and you can just customize here your text this is just an example an example like that and you can update that preview the changes and voila stuff has been created right away so with that being said guys we have now created the first thing the second thing is to go uh, and explore here into the uh, Elementor but if you don't want to use that process into Elementor and just want to uh, actually let's say use it with the templates that WordPress offered to us I want to go in here into the WordPress go into templates and here into templates you want to go into page and you can create new page so here I want to look for a landing page and this is welcome landing page or I'm just gonna tap select and just like that it's gonna be sending us once again into all the feature that it has to offer to us so here what you can do is just to drag and drop all the elements as we were doing that before and after that what I just need to do is to hit into edit with Elementor and it's gonna be popping up the Elementor tool as we were just creating our actual our actual template if you want to edit that template what you want to do is to go back into customize go into the edit side because you want to edit you want to actually um exit this place so i want to go in here i want to click into the theme builder and here are different tools that you can use to edit the option that we just input into Elementor. At the end of the day, um, it's going to be really easy to actually customize your actual website if you are using Elementor. But if you don't want to do this, I mean, you can deinstall, uninstall the actual plugin and you can just, just uh, choose into the edit with Elementor and add your blocks as you are creating more and more elements. For example, I want to choose block and here I have a lot of installations that I can just drag and drop into my actual WordPress. So with that being said, guys, we'll be reaching to the very end of the video. This is just like a few steps that you can do to have like a really, really great block section into your actual, uh, into your actual WordPress. So thank you once again for watching the video guys and I will see you on the next video. I'll see you soon.